Katie Campbell always wanted to go to Gonzaga to play basketball. However, that's not where her journey started. It was actually at Ventura College, a JUCO school. But it wasn't long before she had the Zag's attention. Before coming to Gonzaga, I was, I was in like state for my junior college, and I get a call that Gonzaga was going to be watching my next game, or they had just watched a game. And I was so thrilled because this is the school that I wanted to go to originally. Honestly, just before I even came here, um, one of, that was one of the big moments. Like they're back, they're back in the picture. They're they're interested again. She committed to the Zags after that season and joined GU as a sophomore. And as she started playing at Gonzaga, many questions filled her head. Well, first I was scared I was never going to start at Gonzaga. I was like, oh my gosh, like. I was like, am I going to get in, you know? Like, my first year was really rough for me. That didn't stop her from flourishing. By her senior season, she was doing it all. She was a starter. She was a leader. The guard had a complete offensive game, hit big shots, and played great defense. It all came together until it all fell apart. That was in a home game against BYU this season. I got super aggressive before I stole that ball, super quick with my hands, and, and it was a layup just like any other one, and so... Watching it, it was just weird how my leg did go in. Just like that, Campbell's senior season and her playing days at Gonzaga came to an end. A routine play that ended with a torn ACL. When I was sitting in the locker room or in the training room and having to face the fact that I'll probably never play at Gonzaga again or put a jersey on again, it was really hard. I couldn't do anything but cry and, you know, like, Again, say, why me? Why does this have to happen? That was tough to get over mentally, but Campbell did. And it helped that she had a lot of support from the Zags community. When it ended all of a sudden, and I tear my seal, and um, I can't play for these people anymore, still seeing, like, I have 20, 30 letters that I got from people just reaching out to me, even before they knew the news, just praying that I was going to be OK. Um, after they got the news, still right there for me. It just showed me that they really care for the person as an individual. Even if I'm not um, entertaining them on the court anymore, they're still there for me as a person outside of basketball, which is really nice. And one of the reasons why I chose Gonzaga was the crowd and the family atmosphere here. The injury was certainly an unfortunate ending, but it surely didn't define Campbell's career at Gonzaga. And it's the good memories that she'll always remember the most. When I committed and when Lisa came to my house to visit me, and then just kind of putting on the uniform for the first time, all the bonding we did there, and it was so much more than basketball. I mean, obviously the big wins, like Stanford or um, even Missouri State was a great ranked opponent right behind us. Just so many great memories that started before I even walked on the floor here um, is what I remember.